What's up, car fighters? I'm here with Raptor Slevin. Yo! And I'm Maxon. And as you can see, we're in the basement of fa uh, Fanboy 3. Well done. Great nature. The circle of life. A circle? Yes. Not a triangle. Can I do this again? Yeah. We'll find out. Not next. a triangle, a Not circle. A circle. A circle. The circle of life. Yeah, Not a square, that's used for a circle. You're either in the circle or you're out of the circle. Are you in the circle of trust? We are. <laughs> that was no, that was so gay. <laughs> right, okay. Right, just tell me about this because I... No, nothing. They, I don't understand them. They are blowing themselves up. They, they, they are, are hamsters. They are animals. <laughs> that's yes. what it looks like. Have you, ever, have you ever played Lemmings? <laughs> that's what it feels that's, like. That's, 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 that's great. Great nature all about giving themselves stupid amounts of power and then blowing themselves up because they gave themselves stupid amounts of power. Yeah, but they blow themselves up. But, but they have guys that search or draw when they blow up. Right, okay. So they replenish their forces. And then, the uh, and then you can, like... It makes the decks thinner. Yeah, and you was like, and this, so this, crits are better. these aren't a trigger. This isn't a trigger. I get all these non-triggers out the deck. Ah, okay. I understand it a little bit. So let's let's break this down. What what do we do with our guys that blow up and search other guys? Well, I think we'll start at the top, shall we? Start with the Great Zero and work our way up. Start at the top and work our way up. Yes. Okay, Max. And let's start at the top and work our way up. It's, it's Jungle Book reference. I got the top, I had to stop, and that's what's been bothering me. Oopie doo, it's more animals! Oh, oh, oopie doo! I want to be like you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Right, if you started with that, and I'm not just it like. It was a subtle reference, and now I. Oh, I don't understand subtlety! You've met me before. Right, great zeros, great tell zeros. me what they do. There's one guy, both 5k, which is good, because they both move out, so. 5k is cool. 5k, 3 5k guys are good. One is when you put it back into the soul and you give a uh, money a great nature unit when it blows up at the end of the turn you draw a card oh that's nice it's okay it, it's yeah. it's a it's not it's a break it even looks. and you've got another one it's again 5k moves that's all um you can blast two you give one of your Flask guys Flask monkey he's called Flask the, other, monkey. the other one's a power i can't remember he's, but he's a power guy. so you you know you get cool guys to start um, with. That power. with the monk the fast monkey uh gives 4k to uh, Canvas 2, you give 4k to when you create nature Is it Canvas 1? Yeah, oh, Canvas 1. It's, be it's much better. Uh, Canvas 1, and then you give 4k to when you rear guards, and then that rear guard blows up at the end of the turn. Well, we got again. Uh, so, you can, give it to, you can give it to itself to make it a 9k booster if you really want to. <laughs> and then blows itself up. Yeah, it goes, oh, awesome. I don't want this booster anymore. Kill yourself. Yes, sir! <laughs> 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 And <laughs> like, eats a grenade. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, that's what I see all the time. <laughs> What's that command to blow up? Okay. <laughs> okay. Great, great ones. Great ones. We have... Uh, a pencil squire. We have the hamasuke. What, what what's a hamasuke? Do you? Cause it's, a, it's a it's a it's a hamster with a oh! with a pencil. Ah, oh, no, no, like hamasuke. Yeah. Is is that from Hamtaro? Maybe. Yeah. That was a show. Hamtaro. Hamtaro. That was a show that competed with Pokemon for about half a second. About two two minutes, <laughs> and then you realised Pikachu, another <laughs> rodent, was on, and we're like, nah, that guy. So yeah, he's uh, um, the pencil knight. Well, the ham suitcase series is pretty cool. Um, pencil knight, squire, pencil knight, and pencil squire, pencil knight, and then oh pencil, yeah, pencil hero, hero, hero pencils. All of the same effects. Can't blast one. Uh, when they get get another to hand when, when they die. When they retire, basically. when they retire from the um, the uh, vanguard slot, you can blast one at the end of the turn to add one to your hand. Um, so it doesn't actually matter how they go if your opponent starts killing your rearguards you can do it that way mm -hmm. um, or if they not take just Berserk Dragon or Kimnar or something you can get another back alright so you're just, you're just paying the counter blast so it feels automatically like Tajikaze 
Yeah, in a way. But the thing with Tachikaze is that you don't have other guys that give you other guys 4K. And then they blow up. With Tachikaze, it's you're killing them for a cost. Right, okay. I, I, get, I get you now. Yeah. I get you now. But with, with a great nature, it's more of a recycling kind of thing. Right, okay. But they so they do run out in the theory of these guys. Maybe. They might run out. They might run out? They why, might. Why aren't they going to run out? We'll find out later. Oh, that's future. Future. I don't know now. Anyway, what's... So, we've got a guy that we have, feels like recovers himself in a way. So, we need to... Do they have the te- the uh, 10k booster, which every... Uh, they have a 10k for the Vanguard. For the Vanguard. It's a they thermometer giraffe. Ugh. It's a giraffe, it goes. I, I have no squabbles with giraffe, but thermometer. I, I don't understand. Well, its neck is a thermometer, dude. A one that you're gonna stick it up someone's ass, like you normally do. I think, I think it's do. more like an indoor thermometer. Like, what temperature is it? Oh, I right, can't okay. see. It's too fucking high. <laughs> <laughs> it must be boiling while I'm melting. <laughs> uh, basically, it's six k. If your opponent has two unflipped damage, it's ten. No, boost for 10, sorry. Right. Uh, one problem there, 2 one foot damage. Yeah, it's... That, not, that's that's it's... an opponent, like, being bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm better because my opponent is bad. Well, I don't know. There's a couple of decks that don't counter blast that much. Royals don't counter blast that much. True, they they rarely do. I mean, they only get Duke like... builds don't counter blast that much. Well, they've run Vivian now, but... They... Yeah. But then I think they're going to not run Vivian very soon, so yeah. it's, it's really iffy. Um, it's like it's 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 likely that a, your opponent will have like two hundred damage for a while, and even if he doesn't become useful, you still can set on fire and make it ten k or something. Oh, so he goes ten. I'm useless, therefore I can be ten k and then blow well, up. Well, you may as well make it ten k and then blow up. I suppose I'm just going to retire this. Okay. <laughs> okay, I see your logic. Yeah. Um, it's interesting. The, yeah, for the last grade one, which is pretty cool for a grade, se- it's seven k. When he attacks, you can give 4k to any other units, and that unit will blow up at the end of the turn. Well, now now you've got that's an actual guy that makes the, the actual deck work. Yeah, that is, up. there's like a whole little group going together. So it's all really it's all about the Hamsuke and the Tigers, really. With Tiger and Hamsuke, the boost, and the Hamsuke just searching itself out again. Okay. So it's like the this Tigers works. eats the this hamster, works. and then the hamster. Gives birth to another hamster, and the hamster. I don't know. It's an analogy and somewhere. then the circle of life continues. And then a circle of life. <laughs> Not a triangle. A circle. See all this symbol. <laughs> this could all be yours one day. What about that that shady patch over there? That too. Really? <laughs> but but not that. Yeah, you can have the shady patch. Why not? I can have the shady patch. I yes. thought that was the point that we can't have the shady patch. No, it would be won the uh, legal battle, and it turns out I actually own that. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. We, we had our lawyer leopards. <laughs> lawyer leopards. Lawyer leopards. <laughs> <laughs> confirm for set lawyers. nine. Confirm for set nine. Lawyer leopards. <laughs> Loyal leopards, the Loyal most leopards. noble of all creatures. <laughs> the least noble of all creatures. Surely, surely our hyenas should be the lawyers. <laughs> they, just, they, just, they, just, they just piss about in the office, going throwing paper airplanes at people. <laughs> just going, fucking hell. Um, great twos. Great twos. Pop me up with some great twos. Uh, we have then. a monocular tiger clone, which we, now we have binoculars. So we went from monocular to binoculars. And both of them are circles. Did you not notice that? Oh, didn't notice that. Uh, Monoculus Tiger is a nine k unit now. Um, again, when it when it attacks, you give another unit four k, and that unit will blow up at the end of the turn. And you've got another Hamsuke. It's eight k. Same effect. Count plus one when it's retired from the rear guard's uh, circle. Then you get another one to your hand from the deck. And they have an eleven k grade two. So they've got their own genocide jack. Okay. Um, except it doesn't, it doesn't actually have restraint. Oh, right, okay. It <laughs> just has it just has an ability. At the end of your turn, you have to retire one of your great nature rear guards. Oh, but not, you're not boosting them. If that's what you want to do, you want to boost. That's true. First. But you can still use Hamsuke with it. Yeah, oh. It's 11k. You've not really used 11k for a while. Yeah. I've, I've, I can't remember the last... If you're getting guys constantly and... 
like we well, have to you remember, know searching them and but with tigers you, it turns into a 15 on its own hmm okay and, it blows and then, then it blows itself up and therefore blows up no one else yeah ah you see now crafty ah 50k on its own <laughs> <laughs> blows itself up just I don't understand why they're blowing themselves <laughs> up for 4k it's for 4k 4k is pretty good it's better than 3 Okay, but in that instance, it went from 11 to 15, which for 10, you know, K Vanguards is good, but it's not 16. But they, so that's unboosted, 15 unboosted. You have a 6K guy in 20 Okay, watts. so, okay. Okay, maybe. Yeah, I see. Yeah, okay. May yeah. Oh, yeah, it just, it's just hurts in my head. They're killing themselves. But why... There's secret guy of secrets that we must discuss later, though, which makes the whole deck broke, basically. Right. Okay. There well, I'll, I'll hopefully we'll let that happen, but we've got to go through the grade threes now and convince me that well, the killing our guys is better. Can we do that? Yes. Yes, we can. Can you can you convince me that killing my guys is better? Yes. Okay. Okay. What do we have? The first guy is armed instructor Bison. Uh, as I read his effect off this piece of paper because <laughs> I can't remember these things for love or money. Oh right, yeah. Um, his lunar break is if you have a if a one of your great nature units is retired during the turn at the end phase, you can unflip two damage. Um, so things like Hamsuke Knight, uh, but Hamsuke Knight for the most part, it means that if you have like no counter blast left, you can at the end phase unflip two. And then flip right. one okay. and get a Hamsuke back. Hmm, that's cool. And the second effect is there's not there's never been a really effect that unflips for like free, uh, like, except for the trip and stuff like that. But they have to but yeah, but they, they have, have to attack. Free, yeah, and yeah. then they have to they go just ten ten k and just don't care. It is like, a ah, ah, ah. So maybe they felt that was worth. Okay. Out. So um, it has to be Vanguard. So yeah, maybe that's, um, that that sounds cool though. You know, actually. Get the circle of life moving again. <laughs> yeah, the circle of your damage. So <laughs> the circle of from flipping. And then for his second ability, again Vanguard for Counter Blast Two, you can give plus four K to a uh, one rear guard, Great Nature units, and then it'll blow up at the end of the turn. I don't think you'd use that as much because no, your other really. effects do the same thing for think, free nearly. So. I think it'd be nice to have it in case you wanted to use it. It's better to have it there than not have anything at all. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Um. There's another Pencil Knight, another Hamsuke. Same effects as the rest, 10k. Blows they are pretty up. cool, these guys. I should probably mention them all of them are 10k, all the grade threes are 10k. Um, probably forgot to mention that. Um, yeah, so Hamsuke, 10k. Can't plus one when it dies the end phase. Get another one to your hand. It's probably not as useful as the other two, though. I wouldn't, I'm not I'm looking at that. I'm like, oh, I'm not going to use it. Will the other two? When you get one to hand, that's like that's a free five k shield as well. This one isn't, yeah. yeah. No, that's clever. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't run this then. And I think I think the deck has better grade threes. Yeah. Than well, well, this this bison sounds cool. Unflipping damage. Is M bison? M bison from Street Fighter. <laughs> it's like it powers. He goes grr. I don't know. Uh, maybe. Maybe. For the last one is the last card in the Tiger series, which is the Skull Hunter Leopold. Uh, when it attacks, you can select one of the great nature units and it'll gain plus 4k. Um, it has a limit break, uh, Counter Blast 1. At the end phase, um, if a unit is sent to your drop zone, you can Counter Blast 1 for each unit sent and bring that unit back. Okay, that's interesting. So, are you saying that I can activate this? Yes. Save my guy and then yes. counter blast again, and with, with my with my with your, hamster. With your hamsters, yes. And then get one back. Yes. And just generate pluses. Pluses. Yes. Okay. Generate, that's generate five k shields from that. Okay, bit. that's that's cool. Uh, I could run that. And for the last one, we have school dominator apt, who is a penguin. He is also ten k. Um, he has I, I don't understand why we're going for like all these have been like giraffes and tigers, all mammals, and then we're going for penguin. Because pingu. 
Right, okay, well, I'll, I'll let that slide. It's pink. Uh, we have... It's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he, he, uh, uh, for limit break four, uh, he gains plus 5k when he attacks, which is cool. Uh, when it hits, uh, when its attack hits the opponent's vanguard, you can retire one of your great niche units to claw one from your hand. Right, so, in a way, you get stand trigger then. In a way, yes. But you just call it from your hand. hand. Yeah. But it is after you drive check. Okay. So you can't put... So it's after you drive check, so you can't put on... No, you can Because it has to hit. Therefore, the whole... Oh, right. Is, okay. Yeah. So if you drive check, like, a really good way for you go... Oh, binoculars, Tiger. Oh! Right, yeah. I yeah. get you now. Yeah. Right. That's cool. And he's got a limit break plus five. Yeah. So he's got more. So he's got the, he's got the generic five k. Does it, does he have a booster? For him? I don't think he does. Does he? I don't think he does. Th we don't know. He might. I think. Tell he us if he does. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he does. We we look at all the main cards. Yeah, the good cards. There is a ride chain. That's what we should mention. But it's not as good as the individual cards themselves. It's uh, locks. It's basically the same it's as bar -bar. the uh, Vortima ride chain in terms of when he gets his abilities off and the search ability and all that. Um, basically, its effect is when you ride, um, you select two of your other units, and those two units will gain uh, the ability when they're retired, you draw a card. Hmm. Uh, the only problem is they don't actually have any way to really retire anything. Yeah. Um, it does so have you have to run the other stuff anyway yeah. to do it. Right, okay. And the point is there's an a persona blast as well grade three yeah it has a persona blast and it basically you can choose one of the other units so it's a vanguard only ability you can choose one of the other units and give it plus 4k and the crit which probably wouldn't be so bad but if it could put it on itself i think that would be a lot better but it has to be one of the other units because whatever you pick is going to blow up the end of the turn so and it's kind of blast too when there's like tigers and stuff are doing like for free, free. Oh, you're not, and you're not getting the um, as many. Oh, what's it called? Pluses. The pluses. It, you, you're spending the counter yeah. blast to kill your guys, and you can't use your counter blast to get them back. Yeah, that's why. Go, Ugh, it sounds terrible. I this like it's definitely for me the grey threes I've brought. When probably Bison and uh, Leopold, yeah. they just seem, they sound much better. And like with Bison, you're unflipping damage, and Leopold's getting your guys back for a very minimal cost. Hmm. So it's all very good. So I, I like how you can switch between the two, the great two grade threes. Yeah. That that seems better than I always want this guy grade three. Mm. Sometimes you can want to ride a different grade three. Sometimes yeah. it, you know have different effects cut and you know kick in. So that that's a cool thing because you you rarely see that. Because mm. I get sick of seeing the same grade threes <laughs> and just like well, this is obvious. Okay. Then they have a grade four. <laughs> it's it's not hacks. It, it's true. It's a grade yeah. four. I like how one of its abilities <laughs> is a continuous effect, and it bans itself from the twenty first September two thousand and twelve. Yeah, I'm broken. Therefore, I'll ban myself. Wouldn't it be nice if other card games did that for you? <laughs> That'd be cool. You're like so cool. Yeah, only I like only little times. So many times the wish cards were banned, just banned themselves. It's clearly uh, Bushy Road trying to test the board to see can we get a grade four. Yeah, and it's probably going to be like no because it's going to mess up your deck consistency. Yeah, it does. It does really change ratios, and that's what I don't like well, about the grade four. Well, unless you just from one. It's basically it wants to be cross ride, but can't actually just ride on its own. Yeah. It's, um, it's basically it's grade four, thirteen uh, k. If you have three no. other. Uh, rearguard uh, Great Nature units, it gains plus 10k. So it's a so 23,000 attack. On. If you play the game correctly, <laughs> it's 23. So I should mention it's tw it's 13 anywhere, so it's also Palamedes. Oh, right, okay. It's, all, it's a Palamedes for four. But it's a grade four, so you need to have him out anyway yeah. to make the next guy Palamedes. Well, if you're good at this game, you can draw them when you need them. Oh, right. Well. Duh. The only other thing is you can if, use. If I was that good. There is you can use the um, grade zero that says your deck for a grade three or higher. Use that guy. Grade three or higher. Yes, all the all the clans at the moment have the grade zero. Can plus one point soul. Such deck for a grade three or higher. The top seven. It's uh, like little battle of Kron. 
Oh, so you could. Clever. So, you... so they've done it purposefully. Yes, it's so that they don't trip up. Bushiru the clever? That doesn't make sense. I mean, <laughs> I mean, they are the cleverest guys ever. Very clever. <laughs> right. Okay, the broken and guy. To, to finish off, I think, I will talk about the most broken card. This is just me trying to fiddle about on the phone. This is me talking about the most broken card in all of great nature. Well, not on its own, it's just because how it interacts with the others. Um, it's a 6k, grade 1, and it cannot be retired by card effects. And it's a sea otter. And it's a sea otter. This is with stamps. With stamps? Yeah, he stamps things. That's what he does, he stamps things with... Right, okay, what's... Uh, I've got to ask, what's with the pencils and the thermometers and the, the glasses? They, they work in the school. They work at the university, I think. They work at the university. They work at university. Well, I've never seen these guys in my university. Well, you've got me call me. They're like the mafia. I was like, you don't question that. The, the mafia? The, they're calling me like the mafia of Vanguard. <laughs> <laughs> they don't look at cards. <laughs> I, I knew we... We had pirates, and I re yeah. I respected pirates. And mermaids, <laughs> I respected mermaids. Paladins, and oracle think tanks. Okay, I can understand that. But now we're just, and then we've got dragons. Yeah. In Namakari yeah. and all that, but but librarians. Yeah. That are an animals. Yeah. You never let. A, you can never get a dog in a library. There are no you dogs. Know, there are no dogs in this hat. That's why. Oh, sorry. Uh, tigers. You will never be able to get a tiger in the library. YouTube. <laughs> it has to. It has to happen, doesn't it? <laughs> YouTube tiger in library. <laughs> the, the shit storm that will come up. Okay, so the sea otter is amazing. Uh, basically, it's like with monoculus tiger or anything. Right, so you can turn into a ten k booster. Yeah. And it just sits there and goes. I'm happy about well, it. Well, the thing is, the thing is, he's in the water. He's kind of like sitting back in the water. He's going, yeah. So you set him on fire. He goes, ah! And before he blows up, he jumps back in the water. And he, <laughs> before and he, he goes, explodes yeah. to death. And he's like, oh, I'm okay now. <laughs> what a life to lead and <laughs> do that every turn of his life. Yeah, but it's like, <laughs> it's like, it, it's so good for the deck because it's like a constant. It doesn't go anywhere. Like, it's and like cool, like. What's the because the way the cards interact, yeah. obviously it won't be retired. Kagero can't nature. kill it. Kagero can't kill it, and it works well with like the compass line. Seventeen k. You choose oh, yeah. otter. Otter doesn't go oh. anywhere. Oh, oh, that's cool. So now the and lion's then, good. And, and now the lion's good. And then you choose the tiger, and the tiger looks at, at the otter, and the otter's <laughs> like ah, catches on fire again, <laughs> jumps in the water. Yeah. See, but that's 21 on its own. It's 21, you didn't have to do anything. You got attack. And there's other comps, 21. Really easily. Yeah. Oh, it's so good when we well, go again. Get... the grade 3. The grade 3 Leopold, you got attack. Now this guy's 21. Do I get a trigger? Yes, he's 26. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> we're going to explode. Oh no, we're not back in the water. So when are we going to get that guy? Never. It's a promo. Oh. Yeah, that's the only problem. Get back down there, Get you. Back in the water. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, but, but again, we discussed the promo for um, yeah, yeah, Aquaforce last set. It seems that the new promos that I've been making uh, are oh, they, good. I they're like Purple Trapezist. They, they, they seem necessary stuff. for the deck. Uh, like Purple Trapezist oh, was necessary. No, we have to. Is it going to be in a pack? Yeah, hopefully, right? That's because, what, yeah. Because we've got them in boosters, right? Yeah. We could, we could we could get them in a booster. But it's I say Bush Road TV doing this promo. It's not like the bad ones. They're actually making Good purple trapezist now. equivalent promos where it's like it's the core of the deck. You need mm. purple trapezist to do a lot of the combos in Pale Moon. With Aqua Force you've got the guy who can attack twice on his own. Um you know, but he's ten K you know. But, and now you've got Otter which basically makes the whole great nature deck not minus itself. So how but oh, how are we gonna get these promos that are awesome that would make the deck work easier? Oh. Maybe. Bushy Road, what are you doing? Apparently Bushy Road lives up here now. Oh, he's god. <laughs> he's they god. are Bushy they are god. Bushy God. Bushy God. So many I understand the deck now. Yeah. Thank you for explaining it to me, because I was on, on the impression they were just Tacticaze. <laughs> New version Tacticaze where they just blow themselves up. And like, 
Uh-huh. But, they don't, but as I say, with the difference is Tachikaze does it as a cost, whereas Great Nichi does it more as a passive thing, and the whole deck is oriented around it. Yeah. And it's like, you give your guy a boost before it dies. So and like, you're not blowing up your hamsters unnecessarily. Yeah, it's... It's pretty funny. And again, <laughs> again, plus you know, like most of you guys are giving 4k to have going to blow up. Yeah. So it's more power plays as well as retiring, whereas Tachikaze just it's just a cost. It's time to go. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Maxon. Sorry. Ah! Ah! <laughs> right. Well, uh, I've been Maxon. I'm Maxus Levin, and we have to go. <laughs> ah!